Eerste dag Werchter, eerste interview van de eerste dag Werchter. En dat is niemand minder dan Nathaniel Ratliff en The Night Sweats. Hi Nathaniel en hi Joseph Pope III. How are you doing? I'm doing fine, but how are you guys doing? Uh, a little sleepy, but pretty good. Yeah. Sleepy, how come? Uh, because we live a really weird life and we just woke up. Woke up where? Uh, in Brussels, and then we drove here and slept on the way here. And yeah. yeah. Okay. yeah. Well, it's your first time at Rockwerchter, I imagine. You can see it from here. What's the first impression of the festival? It looks really nice. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of like a beach with trees. You're driving around Europe with a very good reason. You're going to play here. Um, it's not your first time in Belgium because a couple of weeks, days ago, you played at the Depot in Leuven as well. How is it going for you guys in Belgium? Like, how are the fans? Because we don't know you for that long. How how is how does the crowd respond to you guys? Uh, it's been great, and uh, our second single is doing really well here, and so we're pretty excited about that. Um, I need never get old. It's yeah. doing really well, so. And we did, had it, no idea that was happening until we got here, so it was a really nice way to be greeted by the Belgian audience for the first time. Yeah. And now, for a huge festival, I see you have lovely accessories. Can you elaborate? Why do you why do you have like the blue uh, earrings? Um, I don't know. Maybe I'm just very excessive compulsive. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> How so? Uh, no, I mean I just started with um, you know with yeah. rings. Thing for turquoise. turquoise. Yeah. yeah. And why that color? Blue is great. It's a nice color. Blue and black. It's all the only, the only colors you need. So. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Nicely done. And do you? And you just go with the flow. I got. I guess I got the memo. I think, I think it's just like once you get to your 30s, you end up wearing all black. Basically, <laughs> if you're in a band, like it's funny to go somewhere, especially in the states, and yeah. you're playing with another band. Yeah. And everybody shows up in like a black t-shirt and black jeans. You're like, oh, you got the memo. You know, make sure you wear the uniform. So. You can check it today. So everyone who's, who's 30 and older, like Robert Plant, Paul McCartney, uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers, they were, they're going to wear blue and black. Maybe not those guys. Yeah. Yeah. Flea's not going to have a shirt on, I'm yeah. sure. So, exactly. yeah. yeah true. And I also noticed that you have, I didn't see it until now, you have, is, are those like real tattoos? No, I got them like, I draw, draw them on every day, it's something different. No, but seriously, like a bird, I see a bird, can you, what, what does, what do all these this, mean? Uh, yeah, we play this great game with my little two-year-old boy, Joseph Bernard Pope IV, uh -huh. where, where he goes like this. And I go. <laughs> or this one. It's a cricket. No. Oh, you're like a living soundboard or something. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> I got all sorts of tricks, just can't show them right here on TV, oh, so. Okay. Oh, one more, maybe. Uh, sh I don't have any. That was it. When I, when I push the heart. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going to do like. Yeah. yeah, no. Okay, okay. You got all sorts of tricks, we're going we're gonna to see them. No, uh, no. I was just kidding. On stage, maybe. Exactly. A another trick, a musical trick.